from VOA Learning English, this is the Education Report. On December 16th, 2014, Taliban militants attacked Pakistan's Army Public School. They killed 132 children and 13 teachers. One U.S. group is helping survivors of that Army Public School attack explore new educational possibilities. Twelve male students and two of their teachers recently completed a two-week study tour in the U.S. The Washington-based Meridian International Center invited them. The group took part in a nanotechnology research project at the State University of New York Polytechnic Institute in Albany. They also met with American students and officials. Stuart Holliday heads the Meridian International Center. He said one goal of the trip is for the students to make friends. Mr. Holliday added that the students are learning skills that will help them be successful back home in Pakistan. William Barth is one of the four American students traveling with the group. He attends Ridgefield High School in Ridgefield, Connecticut. He said his understanding of Pakistan has changed. He said now he knows you can find common ground with anyone if you try hard enough. The students took part in a nanotechnology program while at SUNY Albany. The boys formed groups and each had to think of a nanotechnology invention and business plan. Then they presented their ideas to science and business leaders. The students lost many friends in the attack on their school. Hopefully, the new friends they made in the U.S. will help the healing process. For VOA Learning English, I'm Carolyn Prasuti.